Hi guys, it's a beautiful day once again and welcome back to Dexter's World Channel. How do you live a worry-free life? Or in other words, how to live a happy life? And this is what I am going to share with you. Actually, I don't have the formula because each of us has different experiences in life. We have different circumstances. But what I'm going to share with you now are the things that effective in as far as I am concerned. Actually, before I am a warrior, I worry so much about the future of my kids, about the future of my career, and I worry so much about the economy and the things around. But I changed my mind, and it's the renewing of our mind that will enable us to realize that this life should be spent happily. As you can see, we're so busy trimming down the branches of the tree. Of course, we need the tree in order to give us the shade. But this is too much already, so we have to cut this down in order also to not to deprive our face from the sunlight because they needed the sunlight. And you will see that the water is actually turning green, but it's okay. It's a good environment for our fish. Just this morning, I prepared a food for our fish. And this is also one of the things that I would like to share with you. That if you are feeding your catfish, then be sure that you are going to soak the feeds with water first before giving them. And this has been our practice ever since we started this catfish farming.
and you will see that this tank is actually now being uh, utilized for our grow out of the catfish babies actually we have in here more than a thousand catfish babies and i told you about the experiment that we're gonna make we will try to grow out for three months period we will make a comparison whether we gained with this project of course we will compute the amount of food that we spent and the value of the fish that we're gonna harvest in the future but i have a little concern over here because the frogs are also enjoying the fish pond and we have to get all these frogs because they're poisonous and please watch this out as we're gonna catch some of these frogs of course i know that these are not good because aside from they're eating the feeds they're also urinating and i think this is not good for our fish so we will start catching now get inside here i will not kill you i will only bring you out there okay this is one frog and we have another one here oh frog you're so naughty oh, oh come on get inside ah! <laughs> you're so clever these are the bullfrog that it's seen all over here they can be found in the rice field <laughs> i'm enjoying this fragment uh, okay there are four of you here and another four out there oh do not scare my fish you are scaring my fish so that i will get you out here good that you are not biting okay oh have here ah, three frogs have you ever thought of petting a frog well, in my case, I am really tempted to pet the frog. But since there are so many all over here, so I did not put too much concentration about, you know, frog farming because uh, this skin of the frog can be also used as the keychain, wallet. So these are actually the derivative products that we can do out of the frog. But uh, for the meantime, we will not pet this frog but we will throw this or we will bring this out very far place so that they will not come back i understand that during rainy season it's a breeding season for them and they will find a place where they're gonna lay their eggs and this is the place that they have chosen so we will bring this to the farm and then we will release this frog right there So this is gonna be a best place for this frog. Okay, come on, go. Don't go back to the house. This is quite far already, and I believe that they cannot anymore go back. It can multiply here, but uh, they will not, of course, be allowed right there at home. Come on, you go. Come on, come on, go. This is the best place for you. You are my favorite. <laughs> And by the way, we are fixing our dikes and uh, we will continue on with our project here. It's just that I was too busy with my work schedule and we're also being bothered by the flood. But I believe so that the soonest possible time, we will start again developing this farm. And this is actually now the best place for our farm animals. So that's gonna be an exciting thing to watch here and i hope that uh, and i hope to realize this very soon so this goldfish is also one of the sources of my happiness i'm really fond of tropical fish and what we're gonna do today is we're going to fix something here in relative to this we are going to transfer all the fish right here because we wanted to put them in a bigger tank so that they will be prepared for conditioning meaning that they will be prepared for breeding and 
Talking about fish, we were able to hatch so many fish and right now we are actually flooded with the several varieties of goldfish and I'm so happy about this because these are actually the product of our hard work, the product of our effort. I wake up early in the morning just to attend to all these things that it gives me some joy, relaxation and of course the healing of my, my inner being. I told you that before I was a warrior, I was really that person who can be depressed so easily. But I kept my mind very busy about doing things, the things that I love to do, and these are all the products now. The sources of happiness are just around the corner. It's just for you to be able to discover what is best for you. And this is my suggestion. Begin to discover the things that you would like to do. Keep busy and have faith in God. I hope guys that you are entertained with this video. And if you are not subscribed to this channel, may we humbly ask you to please subscribe and hit that notification bell because we are uploading videos every two to three days now only here at Dexter's World